Just to Possibly. fit your curve? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I like it. Yeah. Otherwise, again, playing around Blizzard. Um, also, just playing around the Doomsayer that's on the board. Let's face as possible in the following turns. Like, Whoa! Yeah, yeah e even uh, Arcane Golem, because if he gets all that damage in, uh, and, and there's going to be... He can pop the block next turn. He actually yeah. has to Ice Block next turn. That's going to be three of his mana. Yeah, so basically with this play, this Ice Barriers are useless now, because we're thinning out the deck. Mm -hmm. So more possibility to draw Alex draws on the next few turns. Yeah, and he knows that there's no point of freezing here because the block is going to get popped the next turn. All right, here we go. Two draws for Alex Straza. How many cards does he have left in his deck? Let's see if we can get C before he comes out. Come on, spectator. There we go. Oh, the mouse really? is alive. 17. 11, 11. cards. So, 2 in 11. That's about 1 in 5. That's not very likely. Here we go. We'll see the first. Ice, Ice barrier. barrier. It's useless. One more draw. Trap is actually kind of a hindrance. Oh! <laughs> the last card that he needed. And, of course, we say that. Great. That's what he needed. Oh, Chucky rolls his eyes yeah. slightly. But he's not out of the woods yet. There's still an explosive trap up. Another explosive. The ice barriers are active. Oh, speaking of ice barrier, here we go. He's got two of them. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be uh, 16 additional HP for Raynad. Yep. Plus he has Archmage Antonidas. He can actually Archmage Antonidas ice in his last 10 cards. So a lot of these cards have sat dead in his hand for a lot of the game. It could have been any. But she came just in time. All right. I really love Alexstrasza's uh, golden portrait, by the way. Yeah. Look at that fire-breathing dragon. <laughs> it is a fire-breathing dragon. Okay, so with this line of play, uh, Raynad, he he sets up lethal on the next turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't think Chucky can find a way out of this. Because in order to win, he has to pop the ice barrier. But if he pops the ice barrier, then he loses regardless. What a turnaround again. Uh, just a, uh, almost a 1 in 5 for Raynad to win that game. And he exactly draws the right card. And it's just, with that one card, it changes from almost 100% to lose, or exactly 100% to lose, to 99.999% chance to win. Yeah. Raynad very, being very zen at this moment. All right. Yeah. Chalky knows he can't win. We've seen a lot of uh, somewhat like premature concedes when players know they can't win, but mm -hmm. they just don't.